Hey ladies, I just wanted to come and talk about a CVS coupon situation because I know that there are so many people throwing away money that it's not even funny. There are some CVS coupons that you guys are ignoring or throwing out or saying that, oh, this coupon, it's not going to do me any good and just setting it to the side, maybe even have a a stack for no good coupons or whatever the case may be but i'm here to tell you that those coupons are workable they're doable and so let's have a second look at them and just as a side note i did my first dollar general coupon deal last week now um i'm a cvs -er. i'm a cvs girl that's for sure cvs is is my favorite store by far to do my coupon in. I feel it's the best reward system. Um, they don't go through all the mess that Walgreens go through. Don't get me wrong. I like Walgreens. I love Walgreens. But CVS is my favorite. But anyways, I went to Dollar General last week. Uh, and actually, I think it was probably my first time couponing there. If not, you know, there's only been a few occasions. I used to shop there on occasion, but not necessarily um, do my coupon in there. You know, I might have went there for some penny deals or for some clearance specials or something like that, but not really done a lot of couponing. Anyways, I went last week, and I just wanted to share this with you guys because I know it's a couponing community that's watching. And I killed them. I did a good job. I was happy with my uh check my transaction i was happy with it got a lot of gain you know i did my thing and i was happy with it and i was ready to go back again this saturday so i just so happened to look at my coupon though my five off of 25 i actually was setting up some scenarios to do some gain again and some different things was setting up some scenarios you know i was gonna throw in a razor or something you know as a filler just to take up some of the slack of the the $25, you know, and just like everybody else. Uh, but I happened to look at that coupon, the five off of 25, and it's saying something about only on these certain products, bath tissue, paper towels, laundry, and dish soap, and fabric softener. What the what? You know, like that was my first time coupon in there. I heard that some people have been getting this restricted coupon, and some people are getting the regular coupons and whatnot. And that was just my first time going. I'm not a regular couponer. So why would they restrict me? I only went once. So I don't understand that. That was just a, a side note. But that's why CVS is my favorite store. Even with all their register situations. And, you know, sometimes the register, it just shuts down on me when I use too many coupons and stuff like that. I'm sure you guys have been through that. But even with that going on, it's still my favorite store. I still get... You know what I need. I get my freebies. I get, you know, whatever I need. I get done at CVS and all these other stores. Walgreens change their policy. You know, all these other stores always change their policies and this and that. But CVS sticks to their guns. And that's what I like about them. Their reward system has not changed. Those ECBs, you can kill them. You know, and so that's why I love CVS. But I was a little upset about this Dollar General thing because I was really ready to go this weekend and this happened. What? I don't understand it. Maybe you guys could tell me something about it. What, what's going on, Dollar General people? Okay, hey, but back to the good part, the CVS situation. I think it would probably be better to show you guys versus um, telling you. And so that's what I'll do. Um, it's just about CVS store coupons that I think a lot of people are missing out on. And you're throwing away money, so stop doing that. No throwing away no money, okay? So let me show you what I'm talking about. I found this major price cut today at CVS on this Simply Boost. And for me, that's golden because I'm a Boost fanatic. Anyways, if you like or don't like Boost, I just wanted to share the deal with you. However, I also want to use this as an example of what I'm going to show you about these coupons. Okay, so I know that I have a brand new YouTube channel. However, I'm not new to couponing. So do you guys remember back in the day when you used to be able to pair up uh, Redbox coupons however you wanted to? And the cashier would just put it in for you that way. So for example, if you have a sinus product, you take it to the counter and say you have a Redbox coupon that is for pain control. And so you would tell the cashier... Um, I use this type of sinus product for my pain. So this 
coupon goes to this, et cetera, et cetera. You used to be able to pair up coupons however you wanted to, and it was cool with the cashiers. As long as it was reasonable, it was doable. And we all know those days and ways are over with, but are you paying enough attention to the store coupons that CVS is currently giving to you? I mean, I'm going to use this boost as a small example, and this is an obvious example. We're going to get more into the detailed examples that I'm talking about in just a minute. But when I found this price cut, I remembered that I had clipped a $1.50 off a of boost onto my CVS card. And this is what that looks like. Now, when you pay $1 for a case of boost, that's called winning, period. And you can do the same. But as we move forward, keep in mind that that low, low price point was only possible with that CVS coupon. This receipt dated 416 shows the use of a store coupon stacked with a manufacturer coupon to make this Schick razor free. And this is a scenario that will probably jump right out at you. But what I want to show you is there are some coupons that may not seem so relevant at the time but they're actually pretty valuable. This dollar off bar soap is pretty common, but the $3 off facial cleansers also pairs perfectly with the Neutrogena soap at $3. And this $2 off CVS cough and cold might not get a lot of play in your binders, but when you use it to get free CVS cough drops, then it might become more of a big deal. And there's no beeps, no issues, no problems. It pairs perfectly as well. Probably one of my favorite finds this week is the $3 off whitening kit or treatment because it works for Crest 3D White Mouthwash, which is considered a whitening treatment. So I use this coupon. I also use a dollar off Crest Mouthwash. Also use a dollar ECB, which made this free. Got back $2 ECB, which made this a money maker. I could go on for days, but instead I'll just tell you, have a closer look at your Redbox and digital coupons because many times they equate the free or cheap items that you use every day. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe.